Hey guys, welcome back to the Nerdy Collector and today, as you can tell by the title of this video, I have bought a Walking Dead collection from my friend. Now these Funko Pops are all out of box. I picked up 14 Funko Pops. Um, 12 of them were obviously get Walking Dead, like I said, um, Walking Dead Pops, and two of them were Game of Thrones Pops. So um, I'm going to go through these now. They're all out of box. I'll tell you how much I picked up the whole lot for. I picked, I picked up this big bag full of loose Pops here. I got 14 pops for 100 pounds. Now, some of you might think, oh, that's a bit much. Some of you might, but when you see some of the pops, you'll realize that I did, my friend hooked me up with a really good deal. My friend that sold them to me was Callum. He was in my um, Comic Con vlog, and he's also used to do this channel with me. He actually has reviewed pops before, right back early in the days of the channel. He used to do it with me. Unfortunately, he doesn't do the channel with me anymore, and he's decided to sell his collection. I actually have brought most of his collection before off him for five pounds a pop. Back in another video, I'll link that below. But let's waste our time. I'm going to show you what I picked up. Right, guys, I'm just going to start off with the let, like the more common pops that I picked up from him with, um, in this set, with his Walking Dead collection. I got a Father Gabriel pop here they are a bit dusty because they've been on the shelf but I've uh, nothing that I can't clean up but I picked up a father Gabriel pop I'm really pleased with this I don't have this all my walking dead pops I've got upstairs I think I've got about seven they're all out of box anyway so these are gonna look nice on my shelf so father Gabriel's the first one I picked up and the second one guys I picked up is Rosita another pop that I don't have like I said it just needs to be a bit dusted but this is another great addition to my collection I'm really really glad I managed to pick this up now I've also picked up Jesus guys as well another walking dead pop that I've managed to get I'm a huge Walking Dead fan, so I'm really glad to have all of these. Jesus is another addition to my uh, pop collection now. These three are the more common pops you can pick up for quite cheap, but I, I thought I'll take them all. I'll definitely take them all out of box. And then the fourth one I picked up is Daryl Dixon with knife and his crossbow. Uh, I really do like this pop of Daryl because he's got his uh, um, wing jacket on, and I, I think it's a really great pop. It looks like Daryl, but he looks a bit too depressed if you ask me with those eyes. But I'm really glad I managed to get this one as well. Then I picked up um, Officer Michonne from when they're in the um, Alexandria and she becomes a police officer in those first few episodes with Rick. Again, some of them are a bit dirty, but I will clean them up. But definitely well worth the money I paid. So Michonne is make a fine addition to my Walking Dead collection. Then guys, I've got Glenn as well. Glenn's another pop that I'm really excited to get. Uh, he is a bit dirty as well, but nothing I, I can't clean up. A little bit of scuffage on him, but like I said, nothing I can't clean up in any of these pops, but really pleased with Glenn. Then guys, onto the few that are a bit harder to get for me here in the UK. I've got Tyrese. Now this is a, a exclusive version of Tyrese where he has been actually been bitten, as you can see there. And he's holding like that amethyst stone. So it's from the episode where unfortunately Tyrese meets his demise. It is a little bit of scuffage on it, but nothing I can't clean off of an X-Acto knife. So I'm really pleased with this pop as well. I'm really glad to have Tyrese in my collection. I have Sasha's sister as well upstairs in my collection, so I'm really pleased to add Tyrese alongside her. And I think I'll show you a whole Walking Dead collection video as well once I get all these pops set up. I will do that. I definitely will do that because uh, this is one of my favourite collections now. And then one of the pops that I was definitely after because he's one of my favourite characters is Morgan. Now this is going for about £20, £25 boxed. I picked him up in with this job lot, so I'm really pleased with Morgan. He's one of the one of my favourite uh, uh, characters in The Walking Dead, and um, it's a really nice pop, and there's actually nothing wrong with this one at all. Really nice, detailed. If you want reviews of any of these guys, just uh, drop me a comment below and let me know. But this is one of my favourite ones. On to two ones now that are a bit rarer. These are out of box as well, but it's two of the zombies is two of Michonne's sort of pets that she has with her. I need to buy the version of Michonne that has the pets with her because that's police officer Michonne I've got, but she can stand with these two for now. But these two are really nice. They're really cool looking. And I know he paid a little bit more money for these because I remember he brought them off of that boot sale app called Spock. I went to collect him with him and he paid a bit more for these. So I got these for a really good price. I'm really, really pleased with these two to add to my Walking Dead collection. And then guys, two of the rarer pops for me that I picked up, the last two from my Walking Dead collection, Collection is this Maggie Gree and um, she is really cool she is really cool is she's got the machete in hand it's in perfect she's in perfect condition I was looking on eBay at this one there was one of her that's actually chipped all on the hair on there now and it'd been bidded up to 16 pounds out of box and uh, in box was just ridiculously expensive so I'm really pleased I've got this Maggie for my collection because I don't think I'll be able to get her otherwise and um, great pop and now my last Walking Dead pop I managed to pick up guys is this this Abraham pop now I couldn't be more happy with this I've got it to 
placed next to my Sasha Pop on my shelf with Rosita as well. And I do need to buy Eugene, but luckily he's new out, so I'll be able to get him for about six quid, I imagine. But this is really cool. I really, really am glad I've got this pop on Amazon. This is going for fifty-four pounds boxed. So I don't know what it's got. So I don't know what it's going for outside a box. But I'm really pleased to have him in my collection. He's in really good condition. He was really my friend um, Callum was really uh, reluctant to part with Abraham, and I said to him, "Listen, if you want to sell him on for more, I um, totally understand that. But I will take him off." Yeah. And in the end, as he's like my best mate, he said to me, no, I'll put him in, you can have it. So I was really, really pleased with that. That was the Walking Dead collection, guys. And I did also pick up two Game of Thrones pops for my collection. He had a few Game of Thrones pops like Jon Snow, Arya, and um, I think and Braun, and I think maybe Tyrion within the axe, but nothing I was interested in because I have those characters. But he did have one that I actually, funny enough, um, was with him when he picked up is the Torment's Giant Bane. I don't mind buying this out of box because I keep my Game of Thrones ones if they're not exclusive out of box. And I don't have this pop and it's a really cool looking pop. I really like it. One of the best characters on the show as well. So I'm glad to add that to my Game of Thrones collection. And also guys, I will do a Game of Thrones collection video too. And this Game of Thrones pop is a rare one. I've never seen this. I was even when he bought it back when he started collecting the Game of Thrones pops and I didn't. So he picked this up oh, a long time ago. I would say a good three or four years ago. And this is Samwell Tarly. I cannot find this anywhere box for a cheap price. This is loose. I got it loose and I, I, he managed to send it to me about the box because he didn't have it. But it's a really cool looking pop. And it's something that I'm really glad I've picked up. And um, yeah, I'm so glad he sold this um, Sam to me and I can't be, uh, couldn't be more happier with it. So that's that. So let me know what you think of the two Game of Thrones pops I picked up as well, guys. I think I've done really well here. A hundred pounds for 14 loose pops. And I'd say what, three or four of them, five of them even, are very rare to get. The two walkers are rare, Abraham, Sam, Maggie, I wouldn't even say I haven't seen that Tyrese, that's rare to get. So I'm really pleased with all of them. And Morgan as well, if I don't know if I said that one. But yeah, guys, let me know what you think of all the ones I picked up in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the like button on this video. I'd really do appreciate that. And like I said, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think, because I am stoked. I'm so happy about this collection. It just makes my pop collection grow and grow, and I couldn't be more happy. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button, guys, to stay updated with all my latest videos. I bring you videos every single week. I try my best. And don't forget to hit that notification bell as well, so you don't miss anything coming out of this channel. And um, he does have more pops for sale. So once I've took the uh, bullet for that money and I've got a bit more money to my name, I might go again and buy some more pops from him. So um, we'll see what he has. He, I think there's just a few left, so I might take those up. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Check out my other videos and I'll see you next time. Oh, and don't forget to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Links in the description below. I'm running a competition on my Facebook page to win a Walking Dead Richard Pop. So head over there, like my Facebook, subscribe to this channel, and you could win it. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye.